Hello everyone, this is Farhan from FarhanReviews.com and this is a review of a new WordPress plugin called WP Traffic Guard. Now this is my uh, review page and my bonus page, link is in the, uh, the description below. Click on it any time and click on any of the buy buttons and you'll get all of my bonuses. Let me quickly show you my special custom bonus I've got for you. Bonus one I've got for you is access to JavaScript Commission Bot. This is basically an extension for Google Chrome and it allows you to generate traffic and sales and commissions um, from Twitter and Instagram. And this is the pro version. Bonus two is a video training guide on how to get fresh content for your site in any niche in just a few minutes. Bonus three is access to the typo there, it should be headline hack. So um, this is just a video training on how to create better headlines and so you can get more clicks. Bonus four is a video training course on how to get a surge in traffic for your website. And bonus five is all the vendor bonuses. So let me just take you up to the product pricing. Okay, let me take you through the pricing for WP Traffic Guard. The front end plugin is $12 and it arrives up to a final price of $17. This is a dime sale. So every sale increases the price. So get it early if you want it cheap. OTO one is the Traffic Guard Done For You Banners Pack, so you get an additional pack of banners to use. That is $12. OTO two is additional blog niche tools for $27. OTO three is 100,000 articles mega pack, $15. OTO four is an additional tool. It's for smart links, $37. OTO5 is um, Smart Links add on. So it's another version of Smart Links. I think an upgraded version of Smart Links, $17. And OTO6 is the GPL license, so you can resell the, the product. So on my, my review page, I've been through all of the upsells, OTOs, go through all the pricing, and I'll give you my conclusion. Now you'll see in the demo um, shortly that I think the product is overall quite good. Um, it's something I've never thought of before because normally I just create a gener generic 404 page or divert them to the home page. But as you'll see in the demo, you can actually get some additional affiliate income um, just by adding a few simple banner ads. And I actually show you in my demo how I created a few quick simple banner ads. And this tool is quite unique because it also prioritizes ads with high clicks, but it puts them to the top of the list. And if they're performing well, they're getting good CTR, then hopefully you'll make some more income. So um, the products are launching shortly, um, depending on when you see this video. And if you click on any of these buttons on my site, you'll uh, pick up the product and you'll get all of these bonuses free of charge and no additional cost. So please wait for the video, for the demo video coming next. Thank you. Okay, I've shown you the uh, review page and the bonuses you'll be getting if you buy from one of my links. Now let me show you the sales page and the product itself and how you can use it. So this is the sales page for WP Traffic Guard. They've got a little demo video and intro you can watch. Um, the pricing is normally $37. They've dropped it to $12 to $17 for the launch. They show you a couple of stats here, so 75% will never come back to your site after seeing this one page, which I don't know if it's true, but I know I don't like going to four or four pages. Um, they show you some examples of why these four people go to four or four pages. So it could be a typo, it could be an old bookmark and something that you've changed, or it could be someone putting a broken link in social media. So you can read through all the facts and what they what they found and this is their introduction to WP Traffic Guard. Um, it's the first one-click WordPress plugin that instantly gives you fully monetized set and forget for four error pages which is I think is true because I've not seen anything like it. You can of course make your own four or four pages but then you won't have the ability to collect stats and to prioritize ads and display them in multiple locations. So this is how it works. So you one click setup, um, use a ready made template or probably better to make your own and then you can start earning. Okay, there's more and more here, more sales info. 
uh, fast action bonus free Canva training. So if you want to make your own ads, they give you free training and so on. Okay, let me show you the product itself. So this is Traffic Guard, WP Traffic Guard. It's part of the WP Toolkit. And this is, I'll show you actually a, a page that I've made. So this is the page that I made. So I did this title here, Page Not Found. You can take a look at these. I did four sample ads, different sizes. These two are 970 by 250 pixels. This is 102 4 by 512. And I believe this one is 600 by 600. So it looks a bit odd, but I'm just testing different sizes. And let me take you into the plugin itself. So this is on one of my demo sites. Up here at the top here, you can add your headings. So it depends on what you want to do on the on the page. If it's going to be just for affiliate commission, you can say, why don't you check out these great products now? Um, so let me just show you a quick example. Okay, and the format is you can have um, small format, so it will be four adverts on the page. Or if you've got big, large images, you can have large format. It will be um, one across and two down. And this is where you include the ads. So you can choose all ads. It will randomize the order. Um, but then it will look at the clicks and the CTR and see what's getting a lot of clicks and it will promote those ads in the top one or two spots. The options here, so you can turn that off if you want or you can leave it on. And if you want to edit the CSS to make it suit your site style even more, you can edit your, add your own CSS here. So let me show you the, the section where you add your banners. In here, you see you can import your banner packs. If you've purchased the, I believe, OTO one, you get the extra banner packs. So you can import them here and use them as you wish. But I just created a few banners here. So this is the banner name. I just give it a random banner ID one. That's the URL where the banner is. So it's in the folder, the uploads folder. That's the image of the banner. And this is the URL it's going to. And this is the shortcode. Um, you can look at these stats individually if you want to see how well a banner is performing. Or you can edit it and change the URL and do whatever you want. And let me add a banner quickly. I'll show you how to make a quick banner. So I'm using Stencil. And I'm going to use it to make a quick banner. So let me just change the background to something different. Um, just plonk in this one. Oops, and this text. Let's change that one to any random color. There we go. So, for example, one use um, that I've thought of is if you want to promote some of your um, some of your content. So you can say, um, check out my free guide on how to make passive. Oops, see it now. Just quickly stretch it. How to make passive income from home. For example, let me delete this one and obviously you'll have a nice oh, let me try a different background. This one. Okay, so, so just pretend that you made a nice design here. And and then they'll see that and they might be interested because if you've got an affiliate based site or you've got a, an informational site, um you can download this. So this one is 970 by 250 download. Yeah, that's fine, doesn't matter. And let me just quickly this one. Okay, so add new, add shortcode. So I'll call it make money at home post. So if you're sending it to one of your affiliate posts, so one of your informational posts, your, your training guides, just put any name in there. Add the banner files, downloads folder, okay and the URL, uh, send it to your own website or to your post, um, let me just quick a pick, po quick a pick, pick a quick post, just copy yeah, this one's fine, copy address, stick in there, Okay, so this is your ad, and now let's go to the, 
So uh, I forgot to mention, this is a random uh, URL I put in, just, just testy for a full page. So now I've got these four ads here, let's see what happens now. Okay, see, now it's randomised them. And um, uh, I'll show you in a second how this works, because um, this first ad here, I clicked on it from another account just to test it, and it has put it in position number one. But this is the one I just put in there, so if you click on this ad, and that's the demo page. But it won't show in the stats, and I didn't, and I didn't know why. But it's because I'm logged into this account. So let me pull over a new browser. Do a quick refresh on it. Okay, uh, mystic on. Click on this one. Okay, fine. Doesn't matter. Now let me go to the back end and go to four four banner stats. And you see this. Which banner was that? Sorry, I've forgotten. That was banner two. So, yeah, um, banner had two, so it's had one click. And it's been shown seven times. Um, so that is working. So let me go back. Let me go back to the. Uh, I'll show you the 404 traffic. Um, so you'll see here the 404 pages that have been uh, entered and that have given you traffic. So what you could do is you could just redirect these two content or just use these for the ads. Um, let me show you banner stats. So banner stats is when you've got a banner on a post or another page. It's separate from the 404 stats. Let me show you an example of a blog post. So banner ad post. Okay. okay, let me show you where, where you get the shortcut from. You go to add banners, and on this side here, you see the short code in the short code column. Uh, let me just that one I made here. Let me just add this one quickly. And what am I doing here? Just a second, let me close this one. Okay, so. going on here I don't want to add this okay so let me just quickly go oh, no, that's fine. okay I'm sorry I had an issue with Camtasia okay I'm back okay so uh, we go to post and right now this this one is it's a new WordPress, I'm still getting used to it. Save draft. Pre oops. Preview, preview. So by now this is the banner in there. So let me change this code. Oops, wrong one. Not a good time. I can't undo it. Okay, let me just copy it again. There we go. And done. Save, preview, yes. And there you go, that's the banner ad. So if I, um, well, let me publish this post first actually. Okay, publish and copy URL. Go back to Firefox. Causing my own problems here. Okay, <laughs> I just happened to show up a 404 page. <clears throat> and there we go, that's the actual banner inside a post. So if I click on this and then go back to the stats, banner stats. So there we go, you see it's got one click shown once. So the stats work. And the banner was shown on the post. So you, I believe you can add it to any page, any post. I'm not sure if you can add it. I don't see why not, but you should be able to add it to your widget areas if you've got menus or something. So it's an easy way to add banners and also to track the stats. And so 
that in a nutshell is WP Toolkit, it's WP Traffic Guard, part of WP Toolkit. And um, I hope you enjoyed the reviews. It's very straightforward, easy to use, quite effective, it's a lightweight plugin. And you can quickly make your own ads with uh, a stencil or a candle or anything else. Upload them and just, just try it, see what works, try different sizes. So hopefully if you found this review useful, please click on the link below or on the review page, click any of the green buttons. I'll be very happy if you buy from one of my links, you'll get some, some excellent bonuses, custom bonuses. And I'll see you in the next review. Thank you, bye.